Hey guys, this is Summer. If you are new here, welcome to my channel. If you are not new here, welcome back to my channel and I greatly appreciate you returning. Please guys, if you are not subscribed, go ahead and make sure you do that now. Make sure you ring that bell so that you'll be notified when I post future content and also make sure you go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you are enjoying this video. Today we are going to unbox this month's BoxyCharm. So this is the June 2018 BoxyCharm. I did not wear any makeup today because I knew from seeing others open it and of course all the sneak peeks and things that we were going to have an eyeshadow First palette thing we are pulling out of the box is our boxy charm that's card but that's the back of the card it has a code for the sol de janeiro um for 20 percent off boxy 2018 and then inside the card looks like this it just folds yeah, out i have variation one according to the card so let's just go ahead and pull out what we've got in here First item we're pulling out, guys, is a set of Luxie brushes, and this says that it retails for $42. This does have um, a Luxie 516 Duo Fiber Powder Brush, Luxie 660 Precision Foundation Brush, and a Luxie Tapered Highlighter Brush. So those um, look really, really nice. I do like other Luxie brushes that I have. It says Precision Foundation Brush with, with less bristle density. This brush is perfect for applying both powder and liquid foundations to create a soft, diffused makeup look. Tapered Highlighting Face Brush. This fluffy tapered brush allows you to seamlessly apply your favorite highlighter to the high points of your face or set this or set your under eye makeup. Duo Fiber Powder Brush. It says use its ultra soft duo fiber brush to apply cream or powder makeup for a softer, flawless finish. So that's very nice. So that's our first item. All right, second item is in this box right here, guys. And I really don't normally wear lashes, but I do think that I'm gonna try them. This is a really pretty presentation for lashes, guys. It really, really is. It says um, Baddington Monroe Silk Lashes. The 3D multi-layered Baddington Monroe Silk Lashes enhance your look with moderate length, adding a volume and length to your lashes. They're, hand, they're handmade with 100% silk and impressive durability, allowing up to 25 reapplications with proper care. And these retail for $28. I'm going to open them up and show you guys. That is what they look like inside the box as well. And there's no eyelash glue with them. So if you don't normally wear false eyelashes, you will need to get some eyelash glue. I don't. So unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to try these out for you guys in this video because I just don't happen to have any on hand. So that's okay. We'll try out some of the other All stuff. right, guys. So next up, we've got the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. That is what this product looks like. It is 0.84 fluid US, um, 8, 0.84 fluid ounces. Um, this retails for... Ten dollars, and it says Brazilian bum bum. <laughs> and it says Brazilian bum bum cream is inspired by the Brazilians. A favorite feature, the bum bum. It's creamy and rich in guarana, a native Amazonian plant whose fruit contains one of the most potent forms of caffeine. The fast absorbing texture contains just enough mica to add a perfect Brazilian glow, as the formula helps your body look and feel its smoothest and tightest. And this is in pistachio caramel. And I'm going to open this up in. This is made in the U.S. again, which I like. And, and show you guys, you know, that the texture of that. Oh my God, it smells so good. I'm just gonna, t I'm just gonna tell you guys. I mean, and you see, it just rubs in really, really nicely. It feels amazing on my skin, and it smells amazing. So of course, you know, during um, shipping, this got thrown around a little bit. So that's what it looks like right now. Yeah. So I could definitely um, see myself ordering full size of this product just based on the smell. Um, of course, I will use it more and see that as well. Okay. So again, that retails for $10. Now, next we have got this Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick, which you guys know, if you know me and watch my videos, that I am a fan of Ofra. So that is the color that we've got. It is in... The color Verona. This retails at $21. Ofra again is made in the U.S. This is Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick is a one-step full lip color that does not feather. These vibrant colors will give you a vivacious new look. They are creamy and soft in texture, moisturizing the lips and creating a long-lasting lipstick effect. No need to use lip liner. This liquid lipstick gives a beautiful edge to your lip look, and it's, it does. I haven't tried this one, but Ofra Liquid Lips, I love them, so I will try this one, though, at the end of the video. So that retails again at $21. All right, guys. We've also got a waterproof eyeliner pencil. This says it retails at $5. $100 vegan waterproof eyeliner pencil glides on smooth for an elevated eye look use along the upper lash line or the waterline and that's what that looks like it is in the shade 
charcoal and it looks like a gray color and I'm not gonna even try this pencil on guys I'm gonna put it in my giveaway drawer okay, but so that retailed at five dollars so the last item in this month's boxy charm guys is the palette from Alamar Cosmetics so there you go guys and you know what else this is made in the US all right guys so this is from Alamar Cosmetics this is called Reina del Caribe and this palette retails at $28. So this palette features eight highly opaque shades reminiscent of the beauty and culture of Cuba. Dive into the pigments and pearls found in the intense metallics or ground your look with the warm richness of the creamy matte. Look at these colors. I'm going to start at the top and just kind of scroll it down. We've got the Cruelty Free Bunny on here. We've got Made in the USA on here and distributed by Alamar Cosmetics out of Miami, This is inspired Florida. by the beauty and rich culture of Cuba, the birthplace of Alamar, featuring eight intensely pigmented shades, ranging from delicate shimmers, high shine metallics, and velvety mattes. Now, what is really cool about this palette, you guys, and I hope you can see this. I'm going to put it up close. Are, or the shimmers are glitters. They're, they have the water droplet, which means that you can use them with a wet brush, if you guys can see that. And then the mattes have the sunshine, so you cannot use them with a wet brush. Um... And that's pretty typical with most mattes and shimmer my experience bag. anyways. So I'm going to go ahead and grab a primer. And we're going to go ahead and do a look with the shadow, okay. guys. So like if I you said, just wanted to see what was in this month's BoxyCharm, then you can go ahead and head out now. If you want to see a look created with a BoxyCharm, then that is what we're about to do. So stick around for that. All right, so we're going to go in first with this shade Coco Taxi, which is this one right here. We're going to go in first with that shade. shade next that is beautiful it is a beautiful We're 
gonna go in under the eye with the El Malecon shade. We're gonna do that one in the very inner corner, and then we're gonna go in with Varadero, that on the outer right there, lower lid uh, corner. Okay, so this is my finished look using the Alamar Cosmetic Reina del Caribe palette. And I really, really love it. I think this is an absolutely gorgeous palette. The colors are stunning. I love that it tells you if they're wet, dry. I've ruined so many palettes by trying to dip a wet brush into an eyeshadow that was not going to accept it. So I think this is fabulous. I absolutely love it. BoxyCharm definitely gets two thumbs up from me this month, guys. Definitely two thumbs up. I loved every single product in here. The only thing I wasn't wild about was the eyeliner. I would have rather had some eyelash glue instead of the eyeliner, but you know, every box can't be perfect. And this is pretty dang close. It really is. Like this is one of the best boxes I've gotten in a long time. Yeah, so this box guys retails, the retail value of the items in this box is $134. And yeah, I mean, come on for 21 bucks. I'm good with right, that. Guys, I did want to swatch these really quickly for you. And, um, I will do wet dry on the four on the for that call for that and I will just do regular on these. So we're gonna start so. at the bottom and do Cafecito, one Guantanamero, Coco Taxi, and Tropico. All right, that is with um, one, that is with one swatch of each color. I'm gonna go back that and do this with a second swatch. So those are absolutely gorgeous, guys. Those are gorgeous, and the pigment is really great on those okay. as well. So now we are going to go in for the top four colors. We're going to start with Varadero, Celia. We're going to start with Varadero. We're going to go to Celia. We're going to go to La Costas and El Malacón. And my so, arm's actually a little damp from the... Um... Wow. My arm's actually a little damp from just wiping off the last color, so these are already going to be the damp swatches, guys. But I am going to still do them twice, but look. Look at these colors, you guys. Like, just look at those colors. They are uh, amazing. Amazing. <clears throat> I don't think we need to go in with a second swatch, but we just will for the heck of it. Oh, these colors, you guys. The foil mm. colors. Those are so flipping beautiful. I mean, they really are. I wanted to share that with you guys. Wanted to make sure I got those swatches in for this video. I am loving this palette, guys. So, guys, I I've actually been wearing this makeup now for several hours because I went um, and ran a couple of errands. Came back, started to edit the video, and realized that I had forgotten to do the swatches. So I went ahead and went back to do the swatches. So I've probably been wearing this for about four hours now. And you see, like, it's perfect still. It is perfect still. So I am loving, loving, loving this palette. So, yeah, BoxyTorm absolutely killed it again. So I'm very super happy with this box. Thank you so much, BoxyCharm. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you are not already. And also make sure you ring that bell so that you will be notified when I post a future content. If you guys would like to see a full review of this palette with multiple looks, let me know in the comments down below and I will add it to my list of palettes to review. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video. Bye.